In Minecraft, anvils are a necessity mid to late game. They allow you to rename, combine, repair, and add enchantments to books, combine enchanted books together for higher level enchantments, and crush mobs. All of these require experience to do, except for the last one. But what is the most efficient way to do it? Have you ever noticed how when you combine books or tools together, it takes more and more experience? This is because of the prior work penalty. The penalty increases at an exponential rate as you enchant items. To be precise, the amount of levels extra you pay is 2 to the power of how many times an item has been worked in an anvil minus 1. In creative mode, where experience isn't limited, you can reach insane enchanting costs just by adding enchanting books to themselves to a, just a handful of times. More importantly, anvils in survival mode only allow you to pay 40 experience levels before the operation becomes too expensive. This only leaves you with so many operations before you're left at the hands of your item durability, or mending. Finally, when combining two items with different prior work penalties, the item with the higher prior work penalty will be used to calculate the penalty for the new item being created. This is very important because later on I'll talk about how people don't combine these properly and it generates a lot of inefficiency. If you want to spend the least experience as possible, follow these general rules. 1. Rename your item before you apply any enchantment or repair it. Renaming an item doesn't increase the prior work penalty, but it does factor it in when calculating the cost. 2. Only repair a tool in an anvil when it's low durability, like a few durability left. Adding 4 diamonds to a nearly broken diamond pickaxe in an anvil will fully restore its durability and only count as one operation. However, if you add diamonds as you go, it will count as 4 whole operations instead of just one. This will make later repairs and enchantments more expensive. 3. Get Mending, nerd. But seriously. Mending is a very useful enchantment, and it's important to get it as early as possible. You can get it by curing a zombie villager and turning him into a librarian. You can usually get Kudrea deals from him. Now for more specific rules. Remember how earlier I said how combining two items with different prior work penalties makes the new one use the higher value? Long story short, you don't want to do this. You can add extra enchantments for not as much cost to a book. For example, if you want to have a pickaxe and add three enchantments to it, where the three enchantments are on separate books, you want to add one enchantment to the pickaxe, combine the remaining two books together, and then combine the pickaxe and the book with the two enchantments on it. This doesn't use less XP, but decreases the prior work penalty on the pickaxe, which makes it so that renames and repairs afterwards cost much less. For my next trick, I'm going to be adding 7 enchantments to a diamond sword with only 55 levels. The way I do this is by adding one book to the diamond sword, combining two books, and then combining the book that I just received with the diamond sword, and then I combine two more books, and then combine the remaining two uncombined books, and then combine those books, and then add that to the sword. This only consumes 55 levels, as opposed to well, not being able to do it, because if you do it one by one, the prior enchantment cost goes too high and it doesn't allow you to do it. 